Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WooCommerce video series. In this video, I'm going to install a free plugin which will help you create a product gallery slider as well as it will help you create product zoom image. Let me show you an example of the product. This is a product and here you will see the product gallery images. Now these gallery images are not creating a slider and you will see seven images in two columns. Instead of that, we can create a slider where all the product gallery images will slide. And whenever someone moves the cursor on this product gallery image, it will open the zoomed image. So let's go to plugins and go to add new. And here search for WooCommerce product gallery. So this is the plugin that you are going to install YITH WooCommerce product gallery and image zoom. Now, if I search for product gallery, you will see another plugin there. This is the plugin Codex here, product gallery slider for WooCommerce. In one of the previous videos, I have shown you how you can use this product gallery slider for WooCommerce plugin, which is developed by Codex here. This is the video. I'll give you the link in the description box and this is the plugin. This plugin also has free as well as the pro version. So in this video, I've shown you how to use the free and the pro plugin to create the product gallery slider for WooCommerce. And using this plugin, you can also add videos in the product gallery slider and the pricing. Let's see the pricing of this plugin is currently $29 for a year and the regular pricing is $79. Maybe this is because of the Black Friday offer. I'm recording this video during the Black Friday sale. So that's why it might be showing the low price of $29. Otherwise, the regular price is $79. And here you will see in the description box, I have added a 20% discount coupon. So you can use this 20% discount coupon if you see the price $79 or different price. So let's go back to the dashboard and we are going to install this plugin now. YITH WooCommerce product gallery and image zoom. Click on install now. And click on activate. So this is the free plugin. This plugin also has the pro version. Let me show you the website. This is the website YITH WooCommerce product gallery and image zoom. And the pricing of this plugin is $45.49. And this may be because of the Black Friday offer. The regular pricing is $69.99. If you want to buy this plugin, I'll give you the link in the description box. You can use my links in the description box. So let's go back. And in the left-hand panel, you will see the option YITH. Click on Product Gallery and Image Zoom. Now you will see these settings. Hide Zoom on mobile devices. So if you want to hide the zoom effect on mobile devices, you need to enable this option. By default, this option is enabled. Zoom window position will be on the right hand side. This is the window size, loading label, lens border opacity and blur main image. Let's not make any changes and see how does this work. Let me go back to the product page and refresh it. Now you will see we have got a slider. Now instead of seven images in two columns, it is using a slider. So I can click on the arrows and I can change the images. Now if I move the cursor on this image, it will open the zoom image. You can see this here. You can change the settings. This is the zoom width and the height. You can change that one. Now let's enable this blur main image, save options. Let's refresh it. And it's not blurring the main image. I guess there is a slightly blurry effect. So yeah, I can go to the second image. I can open the zoom image. Now here you will see the changes. If you want to change the size, let's say 600 and height will be 200. Save the options. Refresh it. Now you will see 600 by 200. So you can change the width and the height of the window. Let's make it 800 by 800. Refresh it. Uh, this is how it will look. 
all right let's change it back to default settings now here you can go to the second option that will be light box so whenever someone clicks on it it will open the image in the light box you will see this icon here so this is how the light box will open all right and these are the settings of the light box you will see the position there in the top right hand corner so this is the position here let's go to the next option product gallery options hide gallery thumbnails from single product page if i enable it it will hide the images the thumbnails let's refresh it all right so you will see the thumbnails are gone and we do not have any gallery so let's enable it let's disable this option enable the slider so we have got the slider here let me save it refresh it and we have got the slider and we have four images in the slider so you will see that thumbnails to show four if you want to change it you can change it to three save it refresh it you will see three images in the slider next option is slider color you can change the background color the border color arrow color let's change this one let's see how does this look let's try this one slider size is there infinite slider so it will keep on rotating auto play slider if you want to auto play the slider you can auto play it refresh it all right so this is the background image and you will see the slider is playing automatically all right i do have the premium version of this plugin so i'm going to install that plugin let's go back to plugins and click on add new i have it downloaded so i'm going to upload the plugin click on activate plugin Let's go to YITH and go to Zoom Magnifier. All right, so you will see all the options here. Activate Magnifier, activate on mobile devices, Zoom Box Width, so it will set up this auto width. So all those options seems the same. Lens Opacity is there, Blur, Activate Slider, so the by default the slider will be activated activate a responsive slider so you will get a responsive slider option here in the pro version circular carousal infinite carousal and auto carousal and apart from that let's go to single product exclusion list so this is the exclusion list so if you do not want this zoom magnifier on any of the product you can add the product here let's go back to general and I'm not going to make any changes click on save changes so i do not think there are many additional features in the pro version you can simply enable or disable some features here and if you only want the product gallery slider and the image zoom effect then you can go with the free plugin so you do not even need to buy the premium version of this plugin so if you want to compare this plugin with the other plugin the codex here product gallery slider in which you can also add the videos in gallery you can watch this video and you can compare both the plugins and after that you can decide which plugin will be better for your woocommerce website so that's it for now see you in the next video do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools if you have any questions please leave us message in comment section and press the like button if you like the video Thanks for watching Quick Tips.